Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. The ranks of the Vigilant have been growing. We have two additional recruits now, along with Hist, who we uncovered on our adventure, what can I do for you? The Way of the Nine. And I went and secured Irander from Nightcaller Temple, who we helped with the dreams in Dawnstar. He was eager to become a Vigilant. I'm sure it beats sitting around in a, a darkened temple for all eternity. And of course, Cyrus, our Knight Paladin, who was in charge of this new branch of Vigilant. And my personal executioner, Executioner of Darkness, the Executioner of Stendar. So we're here. It's been several weeks since the I'm Way of the here. Nine and helping Shavashni to try to learn the stance of RK. Hopefully, what can I do for you, friend? after all this time, she's mastered it. But it's time for us to head back to the Dawn What is it Guard. I can help with? We received word that they need help with something. I'm going to take all of the members except for Cyrus. He'll stay here. But I'll take all the members with me. There have been some what issues, can I do for though. You, with them fighting amongst each other, with them disappearing, and, you know, not everyone arriving at the same place at the same time. So I will probably reduce the number of acolytes, whatever you want to call them, agents, operatives, I'll probably reduce the number that travel with me. But for this last mission with the Dawn Guard, we'll do it together. Let's get going. I'm here to help. Let us pray, mighty Stendar. Listen to my plea. Strengthen us all, and may we all be included in your mercy. In the end, I saw the child for what she had become. Not a girl, but a monster. And there is no... All right, Vigilant. With that. It's time for us to head to Dawn's... Dawn... The Dawn Guard Castle. It's been a long journey, but we're here. You know, it's always perplexed me about Skyrim, how they can have a city Need called something? Dawnstar. And we have a Fort Dawn Guard. I really think the city, Dawnstar, should be renamed. Dawn Guard makes sense. Dawnstar, maybe not so much. Should see if I can get some more training. It is time for me to meditate. With weeks of experience of mining and crafting and alchemying. I've become quite experienced. I wonder where Isran is. I think he can. Let's get going. Teach me. I'm here to help. About heavy armor. I don't know if any of these other people can. Who is Hello, this? friend. Hello. Isran knows how to fight those monsters. He's been preparing for this day for a long time. Hmm. not hiding out back here. Let's see if there's anything good in this chest. Mm, some gold, that'll help. Alright, I'll go up to his room and see if he's there. 
Ja. It's him. With his partner. <coughs> All right, everyone, don't stare. Israel. I knew it would come to this one day. I knew. And no one believed. I need training in heavy armor. Well, at least you're smart enough to want to learn more. I'll show you what I can. All right. That should do. Watch your back. <clears throat> Watch yours. <laughs> All right. Ah, some more gold. Just for me, I'm sure. All right. Let's go downstairs and see why we were summoned. The message came from Soreen Gerard. But before I speak with her, it's time for me to pray and meditate. Stendar, strengthen me. Attunement, all enchantments on an equipped weapons and armor are 10% more powerful and last 10% longer. Magic sounds exactly my combat style. So we'll go ahead and get the Spell Scribe ability. Use it to store the spell you are dual casting. Your power attacks and power bashes unleash the stored spell for free with a cooldown based on enchanting skill. Only works with spells that affect other targets. All right, let's go ahead and get Might and Magic. You are adept. At weaving blade and magic spells cast with your left hand are 10% more effective if you're wielding a weapon in your right hand. Attacks with a weapon in your right hand deal 10% more damage if you're holding a spell in your left hand. So that's how I like to fight. And what, what, what are these power echoes? Hmm, the spell scribe activates twice before going on cooldown. Alright, I don't know what ability I'm going to dual cast yet. I just want to see how that works first before I go all in, as they say. Alright, let's look at... Smithing. Alright, so now we can create both glass crystalline, ebony, and stallrim. All right, and here we have Daedric. Go with that. And that's as far as we can go. Let's look at advanced workshop. I may choose to upgrade one grindstone or workbench to an advanced version for 250. Hunt. 2,500 gold. It improves items one tier higher. Items can be improved beyond legendary. Then this workbench can be disassembled by sneaking. 
allowing you to upgrade another of the same type. Although I've never seen this done successfully, this disassembling. But I'll go ahead and take the advanced workshop. You may choose an item type, one-handed, two-handed, light armor, heavy armor, or archery. Items of the type chosen can be improved 20% better at a grindstone or workbench. Wow, this is a tough choice. Special, if you specialized in an armor type, your attacks ignore 15% of the armor rating of enemies wearing items of the chosen type. If you specialized in a weapon type, you take 10% less damage from weapons of the chosen type. I'll take it. Alright. Don't know what this dragon soul business is about. Smithing is looking good. What have we got? Let's make our heavy armor stronger. Alright, I'll go ahead and take this rise above. If wearing all heavy armor, you intimidate enemies within 15 feet. They lose 5% attack damage, and you gain 5% attack damage for each enemy affected. I don't know, should I look at other? No, I think actually, let's, let's look at one-handed. Forward power attacks with a mace inspire nearby allies, granting them 20% extra attack damage. Hmm. Well, I think I'll wait for the next rank. What is this, 75 to do 80% more damage? I have been working on my archery. I don't think there's anything else I can do with it right now. chose kinship. Buy items for 15% less when trading with the same race. I thought I was doing this with Belathar. Apparently I haven't been. Alright, so we'll do that now. Huh, that's disappointing. Alright. What? My clothing... Stendar, what does this mean? I'm not sure what what I did. Do I still have my my items? Yes, I do. Excuse me for a minute while I get dressed. Serene. I think I saw her in here sleeping. One of these should be her, yes. 
Do you have a moment? I do. Omar and I have been talking and, well, we're slightly worried. Of course. We both realize it's worrying that times. if Eason's even allowed us in here, he must be really concerned. And if he's that concerned, the situation must be pretty bad. Make sense? It does. We've encountered vampires in our travels at bandit hunting. I also did the, uh, the Book of Love quest, which gave me, uh, some spell resistance as well. But yes, during those missions, those quests, we have encountered vampires. So, are you worried about what we're up against? Yes. These vampires are a new threat, and a truly deadly one. Gunmar and I agree that we're going to need Florentius to help. Florentius? Gunmar and I have a lot of work to do here, so we were hoping that maybe you could track him down. Hmm, so that's why you summoned me here. Who is Florentius? He's a priest of Arche. Ah. Well, he was. It's... It's complicated. Isn't everything. He's a little eccentric, but we can trust him, and we could definitely use his skills. Where can I find him? Well, that's the thing. We don't know where he is. Haven't seen him in years. I think he had regular contact with the Vigilance, and I know Isran kept track of them. So maybe you could ask Isran if he knows anything? Just keep in mind that he... Well, he might not like the idea. I feel <laughs> like you're setting me up. Alright, Vigilance. Let's go and speak with Isran again. Oh, good. He's asleep and not having relations. I knew it would come to this one day. I knew. And no one believed. <laughs> I'm sorry to bother you like this, but I need to find someone named Florentius. Who said something? Sorine or Gunmar? I thought they'd have learned their lesson by now. I don't trust that man, <laughs> and I don't want him here. <laughs> well, I knew I was being set up, but Soreen thought we'd need his help. I suppose she's right. I shouldn't let my personal feelings get in the way. You shouldn't. Last I heard of him, he was aiding the vigilance of Stendard Runvald. Really? He may still be there. There are vigilance if there. If he can maintain some appearance of normalcy, I'll allow him to stay. Appearance of normalcy. What aren't you telling me? Alright. Let's see, can you give me any more training in heavy armor before I go? Well, at least you're smart enough to want to learn more. I'll show you what I can. That will have to do. Watch your back. Let's get going. You're right. Let's get. What was that? Good. Obedition for a fight. This what you want? All right. Where is the enemy? What is this? Oh, a bandit. Stendar. Burn the darkness from this nicely done. Bandit. Drag them into the light. Good work. All of you. Let's get going. Have you seen that shrine this of Azura? This is my horse. They say yes. the Dark Elves built it after they fled from Morrowind. Sight to see. Ah, I see the Dawn Guard has outfitted our, our horses. Who are you to uh -huh. me? Wait, what? 
Vampire, look out! Good enough. I come on, but come on. I can't move. Spike. They're around us, surrounding us. By Stendar, I consecrate this ground. Still someone there. My third you will be dragged into the light. Foul creature. It's done. Yours is to pass, and ours is to delight. Hmm. Have to thank Stendar for giving me these powers. It's been a long time since I've spent so many hours outside. <laughs> Yesterday, I think I burned the scales on my nose. It was a peculiar feeling. I'm sure. All right. Not sure what happened to my horse. No, that one's not mine. Wait, is there... No, that's not a horse. All right, I'll just have to summon him. <laughs> oh, vigilant. You make me proud. Let's go. All right, here it is. It was awkward getting up here. I'm sure it's going to be difficult for the remaining vigilant to follow. Hopefully they'll meet me inside. Spell be activating. Something's wrong with that vigilant. I'm sensing an energy around him. I'll make you pay. I'll make They're burning from the consecration. How's that possible? out of here. I'll just leave the armor here for now. Am I on my own? Oh, this is going to be fun. I wonder if they set some sort of a trap for the vigilance. Discovering Runvald. I've decided to document our expedition to find Runvald in my journals, with hopes that, should we fail, it will bring illumination to those who follow us. 
I myself have stood on the shoulders of academic giants to get where we are today, spending endless hours in libraries and private collections. I'm certain that there is some artifact of great power to be found in these ruins, one that the vigilants could find useful in their mission. I do not mean to sound pompous, but I feel as if I am on the precipice of my destiny with this quest. I am certain we are digging in the right place. I can feel it in my bones, and I dream of finding Runevald at night. Even in my waking hours, I can almost hear a reassuring voice telling me that we are going the right way. The expedition has had a great deal of luck so far. After only a few weeks, the first tunnel broke, th broke through into a large shaft leading downward towards where I suspect to find Runvald. With just a few bits of carpentry, we've established our first base camp within the mountains. If we continue to be this fortuitous, we shall reach our goal in record time. M. Sidri. Malachite. And a chest. in the light. Oh, that the best you can do? It isn't, but it should be enough against you. All right, where's the other one? Dead. Oh, there must have been oil on the floor. Collecting the amulets of my fallen brethren. to meditate, I'm definitely going to have to focus on stamina. Especially if I end up in this situation again where I'm exploring alone. Don't know what that was, but don't try it again.
Did you? Over here. Mm, missed. That's clearly not going to work. I don't want to hurt you, Vigilant. Fortunate that whatever this power is that has ensorcelled the vigilant has made them weak. But then again, the complaint has always been that the vigilant is weak. And I suppose this is just proving that point. I hope to disprove that. as I'm concerned, then I must become the strongest vigilant that there is. Yes, someone is here. Hmm, he's not even armed. Yes, it is. The suffering the Daedra cause will not go unpunished. Headaches. Menorn, be merciful. I just can't seem to shake them. The workers have started to report them as well, but while their focus on conversation and civility may wane because of it, they have not swayed from their task. If anything, they seem to have doubled their efforts. Their efforts. I myself cannot seem to focus on anything other than the dig. I sit here now, studying some unearthed Nordic artifacts, yet I feel a nagging call to see how the dig is progressing. 
The other day, without thinking, I picked up a shovel and started digging myself. Fortunately, no one seemed to find this unusual, which is a blessing. I'd hate for the vigilance of Menorn. To think that I'd lost my senses. As we dig, we uncover more Nordic ruins and architecture, but have yet to hit the main chamber. Every day I dream we'll finally reach Runevald, and I can't help but reflect on what this will mean to my reputation. My family will be so proud, especially my father, Manorn. He and mother have always been interested in my studies, even if my sister, Manorn, was not. But I'm most excited to reveal my findings to my colleagues, Manorn and Manorn, and perhaps my mentor, Manorn. Oh, won't they all be pleased? completely indoctrinated by this force, this Manorn. I don't know if it's a vampire, a sorcerer, a Daedra. Mm, there's traps everywhere. One thing I must say, I feel more prepared for this mission than ever. So it's all right if I've lost a crossbow mount. Hmm, interesting. It's all right if I've... These were meant to kill intruders. Huh. All right. More malachite. Hoping to find some flawless gems as I mine this ore. So far, nothing. Uh-oh. I'm here. Why are they not carrying weapons? What was that? <sighs> Did you hear something? Huh? Huh? <sighs> Someone there. Oh, over show here. me what you got. Well, he's carrying a weapon. All right, we'll have to do this the more punishing way for you. You've already lost. Have I? Oblivion. Who else? Where are the Phantoms? What a fool. It's a shame whoever's ensorcelled you has turned you into a bunch of idiots. That one man could come down here and lay waste to the entire 
vigilant contingent is just unbelievable. This was my complaint. Wait, did I see something? No. Nothing new. This was my complaint about Keeper Carset and not really knowing enough about restoration and, you know, not really knowing her job and not sharing it with the Vigilant. You can see how weak they are and how strong I am in comparison because I became a master in restoration. Quite sad, actually. they're not traps here. That's all I need is a broken angle. Alright, so hopefully this will take me around. Hmm. Rand's heavy armor training was quite expensive. I'm gonna need more gold after two weeks of bandit hunting and crafting and alchemical concoction potioning. That money's that gold is nearly gone. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm afraid to read this. I have found my muse, and her name is Manorn. After Manorn was your father, and gods know who else. Reading back over old journals, I realize she has called to me from deep inside Runevald. She is the voice I have been hearing, the one who has called me ever downwards into the mountain. The vigilance, the workers, they hear her too. What joy to learn that I am not alone in her love. Oh, Manorn, how would we have ever found this place without you? As I write this, we are digging out the last bit of rock to get to you. Those without tools have started using their hands. I cannot write anymore. I must get back to work. Runevald awaits. Ugh, oh, I tell you. It's no wonder I walked out of the Hall of the Vigilant. Ah, <laughs> they are weak. But this group of Vigilant will be much stronger. hoped that the Vigilant would be joining me. Uh-oh. Here's another one. Glory be to Manorn. Glory be to the Mistress of All. My life for you, O oh beautiful Savior. Where once my feeble rambling seemed so grand, I now realize they are but scratches on parchment unworthy of you. Oh, that I could properly describe you, I would write a thousand testaments to you, 
Damn my teeny thoughts. If only I were wiser. Manorn asks that we bring more here for her, more to worship her and do her bidding. I have sent word to the Hall of the Vigilance to come. A simple lie was told, for they would not understand. Not until they saw her, O oh glorious Manorn. But she is fearful. There are fools in this world that do not heed to her beautiful voice. The guard, Florentius, sent from the beacon. He still prays to Arcae, an absent tea god who pales in comparison to Manorn. I will pray to the goddess I can see. May he rot in his cage. Oh, sweet, sweet Manorn. <laughs> Ay. So, Florentius was assigned to Stendar's beacon. That's interesting. There's no escape. Consecrate the ground. Ah! All right, this might not be as easy as I thought. Where are those damn vigilant? when I need them. Are you kidding me? The spell didn't fire! I won't! Stendar, take you all! Stendar, cloak me in your aura of might. Your aura of vigor. I think we're done here. So, are you the one they're calling Manorn? No, it must be you. Huh. Look at this staff of Runevald. Creatures and people up to level 8 won't fight. You're gonna need something a little bit more powerful than that. All right. Stendar's mercy be upon you, for the Vigil has none to spare.
Stendar. Bathe us in your light. So, you must be Florentius. A member of the Vigilant. Interesting. I knew it. I knew Arke would save me. I asked for help, and he sent you. You are a very welcome addition to this dreary place, my friend. I owe both you and Arke a great deal. I'm sure I'll manage to repay him later, but you... What can I do to thank you? Hmm. Isran needs your help. Isran? My help? Is this some kind of a joke? Did RK put you up to this? Isran's done nothing but mock me. He's never given me the respect I deserve. I'm not going to beg, but we need your help. Look. I've just got myself out of quite a mess here, in case you, you haven't noticed. got yourself and out? while I appreciate your help, I... What's that? No, that's not what I... Yes, but... Are you sure? Really? <laughs> Fine. Arke says it's a good idea for me to go. I don't agree. But he's not the sort of fellow you can just ignore. I'll see you at Fort Dawnguard, then. Don't worry. Arke will show me the way. Hmm. <laughs> You seem quite touched. <laughs> what an interesting man you are. I think we're going to get along famously. Well, ah, uh, okay. I was going to say, I, for a moment, I had imagined that you were all naked. What can I do for you, friend? Well, it's good that you could join me again. However... Because you Can didn't, you? when I was in Runeval, we have lost a lot of vigilant us both. armor S still there. It was I don't know, maybe we can go back and try to get it for our additional recruits. Alright, let's see what the Dawnguard are up to now.